Hey everybody, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Uh, today, uh, I invite you to, to comment, all right? I wanna know what you think, if you've got experiences with this topic. So in this video, I wanna to talk to you a little bit about dating uh, and intimacy. Uh, so the research shows that people who are happily married or happily in relationships, they share uh, certain similarities and they regularly express liking for one another. There's this classic positive to negative attribution ratio, which predicts relationship satisfaction. And then there's the four horsemen of the apocalypse that predicts divorce. But we want to prevent those things from happening in the first place, don't we? And the first step is establishing similarity. So if you're an intuitive, what that means is that a big part of your life is trait openness to experience. You might be asking, what is that? Well, it's simply an interest in ideas and aesthetics. So as you move throughout life, you might find yourself wanting to read books or experience art, maybe even to create art or even uh, have some kind of intellectual discipline yourself. It's a big part of who you are. So in essence, to feel close to another person, you want to be able to share that aspect of your being and, and ideally have it reciprocated. This is a big part of how we identify who we like and who we don't like. And I really want to hear from you. Have you had experiences where you've been unable to share this factor of personality within intimacy? And, and have you felt that lack? Because I can say that in my own life, that has been an experience that has happened. And it's happened many times. I think a big part of being uh, really mature as an intuitive is being able to discern whether or not you can really get your needs met within some kind of relationship. Uh, be that like a personal relationship, romantic, you know, however you want to define it. But the reality is this. We want to be able to trust one another and really admire one another. There's a great joy in that process. And a big part of that for an intuitive is the ability to be intuitive together. So with that being said, I want to hear from you. What has it been like for you to establish intimacy in your life? Intimacy is a need. It keeps us healthy. It keeps us firing on all cylinders. It helps release growth factors that keep us healthy and interested in life. So I want to know, have you had experiences where you have had that sort of profound sense of sharing in sort of this appreciation for the world at the level of intuition? Uh, and, and, and is that a deal breaker for you within a romantic relationship? Uh, has it created barriers for dating? Uh, I love to hear from you. Tell me what you think with a like and comment uh, below. All right, see you soon. Bye-bye.